how's it how's it going we should be live they'll take people a few seconds um you know what's really weird bob what's that being live looking over and all of the volume all of it is on one channel it's all just yeah mic. that's weird oh obs obs having problems oh no it's fine it's fine it'll clear out It'll point. clear up, unless it doesn't, <laughs> in which case we'll all die. Okay, how's everyone going? We also have Dr. Agro, a last minute edition. Thank you, Mew the Fox, for subscribing for 22 months in a row. For this stream, we have turned off notifications because you know how it gets sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. We, we want to be able to scream really loudly when they show off Goodbye Volcano High. <laughs> 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 the indie darling. We summon thee. <laughs> no, we don't. No, we don't. <laughs> oh. This stream brought to you by to an all new state of the incredible PS5 power breaking into your house. New <laughs> Rift Apart PS5 gameplay coming right up. But first. Let's check in on two other exciting games coming to PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 consoles this year. This is going to be E10, it's, so watch out. It's going to be, whoa. Made it to 4546B. Landing was a bit rough. <laughs> Why is she piloting her ship with a Wii U? I don't know. <laughs> uh, it's it's powered by uh, Starlink or whatever that uh, Ubisoft. No, it's, it's Star Fox Zero. It's like God, God damn it. Frigid underwater adventure. Miyamoto, why'd you do this? Here, the native wildlife above and below the surface might Okay, so this is like a new Subnautica. Okay. Just DLC, I think. The previous research right. crew has vanished, including your sister. This was Sam's necklace. She never took it off. To uncover the truth, you'll need to get crafty, building tools and shelter for your survival. But even that may not be enough. I told you to what? Off my land. With the PS5 what? DualSense it, controller, bitch, it's water. <laughs> The haptic feedback system allows you to feel each Okay, I'm really tired of seeing that cover space <laughs> motion. Encounter key game moments. What, why? What's wrong with it? Probably best. We gotta go. We gotta protect T zone, Bob. Ahead, it may already be. <laughs> That's Fortunately, important. When you play below zero on PS5, players will get a crystal clear experience. Oh, because crystals, I get it. Target yeah, they said crafty and they showed mode. crafting. And mm -hmm. if you What's next? Own a physical or digital version of the first Subnautica on Good. PS4, you'll be able to upgrade to the digital PS5 version at no additional cost. You need to do as we are to dive into the world <laughs> of below zero when it launches on PS5 and PS4 on May 14th. Dear Sony, I have rammed my Blu-ray into my fan. <laughs> okay, then. Ah, oh, this is also <laughs> not good by Volcano oh, no. High. Man, this is my fault. I used the word sus before we went live. <laughs> you, you definitely did. Yo, your chat's really good right now. <laughs> I don't know. Looking at it, it seems pretty <laughs> sus. Oh, you got ratchet horns. <laughs> oh my god! What the? <laughs> that clank is incredible. Yes. I'm going to pass out. That's a really that good is clank. That is 2002 flash clank. I'm here for <laughs> yes, it. Yes, exactly. It feels we real can't strong. Wait to dive deep into Subnautica Below Zero and make Deeper. baseless accusations against our crewmates <laughs> and Among Us later this year. Those were the two like indies. In the That's hilarious. That's Why they even talk about it? Yeah. Lead us on a tour of this June's PS5 Ooh. action adventure. Insane. I'm gonna come in this Popeye's cup. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh. oh. Like we don't like the aggro in the house anymore. Oh, it's an info bot. Oh, she is a. Oh yeah. No, this has an ad for the next level. <laughs> Why well, we gotta know what to do? <laughs> I 
I'm Marcus Smith, creative director of Ratchet and <laughs> that Clank. That dude's dead. The, <laughs> the all Clank Ratchet and Clank adventure built from the ground up for the PlayStation 5 console. Today we're going to introduce you to some of the gameplay, characters, and arsenal of Rift Apart. Whether you've played every game since Ratchet and Clank's debut, or you're brand new to the series, Rift Apart is a standalone adventure that you won't want to miss. Let's get into it. Both of those oh. apply to us. <laughs> Clank? Clank? Wombax? My is mom? This <laughs> <laughs> no! That's my mom! That's my mom! Oh. <laughs> Where are you, Clank? Maybe someone around here has seen him. Have any of you seen a little gray robot? Shit, anywhere? this is gameplay. It looks too good. Yeah, 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 yeah. This, this yeah. is upsetting. <laughs> Please. Oh, that new HUD? That, that hit me like a dump truck. <laughs> Ratchet has been separated from his best friend and partner, Clank, and is now in a new dimension and a mysterious urban sprawl called Nefarious City. Possibly another dimension, new galaxy. Mm hmm. Intergalactic. Planetary. <laughs> <laughs> Big ears. Please let there be good news behind here. <laughs> I look up the chat and I just uh, see the sure, sentence. Make sure to twist it right by the Ratchet way. quickly finds out. <laughs> oh, will he? Dimension. Dr. Nefarious is a much more capable villain. Welcome to the Nefarious no. <laughs> Please remember to thank our marvelous emperor for This is way too dense. Yeah, there's so many cars. Does that mean... <laughs> There are mm -hmm. two nefarious now? <laughs> I believe it's nefarious. Yeah, probably. Maybe he's in this bazaar. Thanks to the new hardware, the worlds in Rift Apart are more beautiful than ever. Cities it's kind of stupid. With traffic and civilians <laughs> milling about everywhere. Jesus. Rift fucking. Apart is full of the unexpected. Look Characters at all that collateral damage. Ratchet comes across Miss Zircon, the weapon vendor in Rift Apart. Oh, oh we're using Miss Zircon as a weapon vendor. You forgot your order. We'll come right in. Miss Zircon will sell you weapons, but you gotta be less conspicuous, or the resistance will not last. The resistance? <laughs> <laughs> She gonna oh, sell you her son? <laughs> yes. Oh office. my god. Espionage. Clank has been taken by a mysterious new Lombax named Rivet. Clank. <laughs> Lombax to have a standard issue way to attach Clank to them. Yes. Well, that yeah. Ship. How can I get off planet? It's a test. Only royal starships are allowed to leave anything else. Phantom can help. Just follow the beat to Club Nefarious and you will find him. I'm trying to look Club at the weapons Nefarious in the background. Oh, and nice work, Super <laughs> oh. Agent Zircon. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh. A so phantom, exciting. and it's a he. Mm -hmm. Nefarious shouldn't be hard to miss. Better look around. I love this soundtrack so far. Like it has, it has some interesting new sounds for Ratchet. Like there's a little bit of Tron Legacy that it was going through back there during that cutscene. Huh. It's real good. Hello. So do we end this conference with a? Lombax, Keanu Reeves, like busting it. <laughs> I feel like they end with showing us Quark. Who <laughs> looks like DCEU what? Superman? Like, no! <laughs> I like, I like that nefarious fucking head boombox. Yeah, Quark in the freaking Injustice Two outfit. <laughs> with the lines. <laughs> he's just he's, like he's just standing in a conveyor belt and it's going along as he snaps oh, next and brings to him. <laughs> Once Ratchet Batman. finds Phantom, he learns a couple of new moves. What? 
Was that huh. a fucking air dash? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we had to replace Clank again. Mmm. I figured we'd go back to the boots. He had them in an earlier thing. Oh, it's like a, a crazy after images where he does it's that, It's like too. a juiced Belmont thing going on. Yes. We got juice day up in the house. Ratchet's gonna master up. One of the focal points <laughs> of gameplay in Rift Apart is increased mobility. Ratchet can now dash and wall run to traverse levels. This focus on mobility allows players to chain moves together to create exhilarating combos. Now let's jump into combat. Nefarious Day Spa. If you can distract these troopers, oh I'll shit, that's a uh, skids. Give this city a skids McMarks, yeah. Yes, yeah, Skids McMarks. Skids McMarks. <laughs> Skids McMarks. <laughs> Looks easy enough. What the hell was he about to say? I don't know. Oh, you can do it on the ground, too. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Dimensional tears in the world allow you to use the Rift Tether, another new traversal mechanic to instantly God, pull yourself across so battlefield cool. to escape or flank enemies. Weapons in Rift Apart utilize the power of the dual sense wireless controllers, adaptive triggers, and haptic feedback to allow players that to ammo really type feel the power nice. of their arsenal. For example, with the burst pistol, players can pull back the trigger partway to peck out accurately placed single shots. But pulling the trigger fully unleashes a rapid fire spread that covers more area. Uh. In either case, players will feel each shot burst from the weapon and connect with enemies. With the Enforcer, players can pull the trigger down halfway to fire a single barrel, reducing time between reloads. Or pull the trigger fully and unleash both barrels with a devastating close-range attack. Thanks to the haptics, the player will feel the power of their shots through their hands. How long till third party you start using these features and then it's just like, yeah, I don't know, it doesn't work on the Xbox. Deal with it. <laughs> no, it's okay. On oh, Xbox, we got some hold rumble the, triggers? Hold the L1. <laughs> yes. Hold the LB. Oh, no, don't even say plans, that. He encounters a nefarious <laughs> juggernaut. Line is a <laughs> Looks like it was made by Apple. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this game looks unreal. Yeah. Yeah. But I still can't get over the air dash. It's so good. <laughs> Is this the part so where I should cool. bring up that Returnal and Ratchet and Clank combat look pretty much the same? <laughs> this fight, more chaos That's what next gen combat looks like. We can near instantly tell us players to completely different locations. <laughs> this isn't some this small not even arena close game to the same the play. entire level from a different planet. God. Right. Oh. The limiters are off. Someone on Twitter's already writing a tweet to explain how they cheated. <laughs> this isn't true strength. Yes. See what's going on with Rivet and Clank. Is our new character Rabbit? I don't think he said that right. As you may have guessed, Rivet is a brand new playable character in the series. Where are you taking me? I was going to take you to my hideout. But first, I got to rescue my friends at their gelatonium factory. Oh, it's that stupid fucking level. But it, like, looks good. <laughs> and will probably be fun to play. Was this in Tools? Is that uh, right? Yes, this okay. looks a lot yeah, like the it, one from Tools of Destruction. Rift I think it's supposed to be. They said the, like... dimension versions of classic planets from past games. Ah. Yeah, they just said it again. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that. This game better have the sickest arena in any of them. Uh, that's my number one hope. That's my number one wish. Did yeah. you mention how stunning and alive our worlds are? <laughs> Thanks to the power of the PS5 Fuck and the 3D audio, we've been able to create alien planets with an immersive density like never before. Let's check it out. Speedles, yeah. That's why I'm Hope she can dash in. too. Soon as I can get close enough. Back to Ms. Zircon, the weapons vendor. Whoa. This wasn't what Mr. We didn't Fun Guy? Last time. Oh, that is because I added our mutual friend on Nefarious City. Okay. In Rift oh, Apart, you can oh, okay, um, that's a good, that's a good, uh, pretty racist. As well as a few returns. 
<laughs> you all know oh. each other, right? You all know each other, right? <laughs> cool. Jesus. I mean, to be fair, Ratchet does pretty much know every Lombax in the galaxy. <laughs> Here's another example of how we're using the dual sense. With the topiary sprinkler, players will feel resistance in the trigger as they prepare a throw of this garden grenade. Once on the ground and spitting out its rapid growth, not as good as bees. Players will also <laughs> feel when enemies have been topiaried and are ready to be trimmed down. Yeah, you, using distinct tactics for uh, notifications is good shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they did it a little in Demon Souls, and it was real smooth. Distortion is emanating from that cave. So much sloth. In addition to rift tethering and dimensional shifts, there are also many pocket dimensions scattered throughout the game. And the last Speedle runs into that rift thingy. Interesting. You must have a rift tether in your glove, too. It, it, it's my arm. <laughs> it's not a glove, it's an arm. What is this place? I, um, a dimensional pocket? Perhaps a symptom of the Dimensionator's destruction. How do you come up with this stuff? It's like those things in Into the Nexus, except not fucking horrible. Yes. Yeah. There is the speedle. No, no, don't hide. Hitting its nest might get its attention. Punish its youth. I'm going slightly faster than usual. Oh no. <laughs> I feel like I need more lines to tell me how fast I'm going. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to assume that uh, Crash Bandicoot warped gameplay like this is going to become a staple in this one. Because we already saw that cutscene that has uh, Ratchet doing the same thing. Riding an animal. Riding yeah. So that was apparently yeah. not a cutscene. Acid swamps, and to do so uh, quickly. <laughs> the composer for this also composed the first three crash games. Look out! <laughs> I got it. And got four it. Ragnarok. See? <laughs> Jesus. That explains a lot. Mm -hmm. Do we do this instead of hoverboard courses? No. <laughs> there will also be those. And they will feel worse. Oh, this is another tools <laughs> level. In his robo I think we're still on the same planet. Just to get stopped by some yeah, she exited oh, the so pocket dimension. Like oh, thug, thugs for less. Yep. <laughs> Ugh, whoa, that's 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 shoot that thing. Like Don't even fucking ask a question. Fucking me want honeycomb, Jesus. Now also trapped in Rivet's dimension. Here's another new weapon. Yeah, it the looks exactly like that. Frag type grenade that deals a lot of damage to your foes. Well, you have to keep back, like each explosion stuff. feels incredibly impactful. Those are like Spider-Man skeleton pops. Yes. <laughs> Where are these coming from? God, the, those explosions look ridiculous. Holy shit. Yeah. Dear Sony, thank you for letting Returnal go first. <laughs> the Returnal walked. <laughs> Hello. Whoa. Holy what? shit. Oh, baby. It's time for payback. <laughs> oh, time. I love this video game. <laughs> Yeah, I, I am struggling to imagine what comes out and knocks this out of my game of the year. a small taste of some of the early gameplay in Rift Apart, but there is so much more. We have open areas. Oh, God. oh shit. What? Of course, they have to have let you hunt puzzles. things. Yeah. They need oh, no. To, they need Blitz to feed, feed my brain yeah. spiders. What? Arena <laughs> challenges. Good. Yeah. yeah. Aerial combat. What? <laughs> Gold bolts to collect. That's important. Pocket oh, dimensions God. to explore. 
That is a giant Ratchet Dragoon tool. remake. And used in the first <laughs> ever oh, Ratchet and Clank photo mode. Ah, ah. Oh, dude. What the and giving more people access to playing our games is always important to us. As such, Rift Apart will offer a slew of accessibility options. We'll reveal more about this. Oh, soon. fancy! Experience Rift Apart's new Hell yeah! Ads, looks like weapons, looks like that stuff in uh, combat and the Last of Us Two is just going to be like their standard features the going forward. We could cool. think it accomplished yeah. something. <laughs> yep. Sony Studios just pushing it. Usually Bob is nice, but sometimes he just throws <laughs> <laughs> the shatter ball. Bob, after buying The Last of Us Part 2 for $60, this can't be for nothing. That's our show. Well, there we go. The depths of an alien ocean. Got a first look at Among Us. Yeah. Guitar is going to be sick in this game. Yes. Oh, man. Why, why, do, why even do the indie things for, for this? We'll I don't know. They wanted, they, they wanted to talk about those for two seconds, okay? So this is the trailer they put out a couple days ago. Okay, I thought that was one. Yeah. What do you want, Nefarious? We're going to a dimension. Where Which means it's going to play Devo and this is going to get claimed. <laughs> oh, okay. So I'm going to pause. Um, yeah. Go watch that trailer yourself. It'll look better in person. Or I can yep. just mute it and play it here. Oh, hey, look at the... <laughs> um, yeah, no, um, this trailer got me extremely excited anyways, but uh, holy crap. Yeah. The I'd... state of play was intense. Uh, this is Devo? Uh, yes. Uh, uh, the composer also is from Devo. <laughs> yes, uh, Mark Mothersbaugh. When you said that, I was like, I assumed he was working on this game. <laughs> <laughs> Dan called that like a week ago when this trailer went up and was like, no, it can't be the case. I literally, that was the first thing I said to him that morning. And then KZ was like, hey, it's, he did Crash 1, 1, 2, 3. One, three, was three. Like, that sounds a lot like that other guy. Maybe it's just someone else who happened to work yeah, on Yeah, someone else. There's no way it's Mark Mothersbaugh. There's no way. <laughs> just get that guy when you do a platformer, I guess. That's how it works. <laughs> Look, Bob, maybe you need that classic sound of just smashing your head on a piano and saying the title of the game <laughs> oh man but yeah no that was that was a really good state of play the indie thing at the beginning was very funny though um mm -hmm. jesus i'm i'm super excited for that i think it's even funnier that the second indie thing among us was like 12 seconds <laughs> yeah it mostly was just hey we're gonna it's coming. We're gonna do this. It's coming. We're just gonna it's half ratchet and clank. Our platform is also sus. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, thank you all for joining us, and thank you MacBook for being a competent fucking piece of electronics and putting up with I'm the stream. Back. Please don't. <laughs> Please let me sit with this thing for a while longer to see if it just shits its pants at some point. <laughs> okay. But yeah, it's nice because like, I don't know how many people remember, but during the entire summer of gaming last year, it kept dropping frames like an ass load nonstop while we tried to stream and I was just losing it. I'm like, this really pisses me off. And this is, I assume it was just not even using Chrome. It's probably just the browser that comes out with the Mac. No, no, I'm using Chrome. Okay. Because <laughs> cause I, I don't want to use an Apple browser. I don't even use that on my phone. <laughs> yeah. Like, I don't want that. I don't need that in my life. But, uh, yeah, no, anyways, thank you all for joining us. Uh, we might be live with Returnal at, like, midnight our time tonight. I don't know. <laughs> We're recording podcasts, so, yeah. Anyways, just keep an eye out. We'll see you all later. And thank you to my co-hosts, KZ Excellent, Mr. Feel, and Dr. Agro. If I had a shout-out function, I'd shout-out all three of your channels. Bark, bark. Woof, woof. Bye-bye. <laughs>